Welcome to episode number eight already. Can't believe it. Plan was to vlog today. Today is Monday for me. You guys are watching this on Tuesday. But as you can tell, the weather is terrible. I can actually see my breath. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it is raining and it's supposed to rain all day today. So no vlog, unfortunately. Maybe I'll save that for later on in the week. I do have a very busy day because today is Monday. So both my classes had a test tonight. It is my active rest day, which I'm looking forward to because I really need a rest. My body is pretty sore. So active rest day for me is just gonna be abs and cardio later tonight, but that's gonna be after I take my test. But what I'm about to do, it's lunchtime. I'm gonna head to campus, show you what I get on campus, and I still stay on track, weigh everything out. So let's start walking in this rain, unfortunately. Yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Hopefully you can hear me, otherwise I'm going to have to redo all of this. But what you're saying right now is, since I go to Seton Hall, Seton Hall men's basketball just won the Big East, so they had a big cake out there. Obviously I'm not going to participate in any of that or have any, but we did win the Big East, so kind of a big deal around here. Then the way I make the rice is they already have kind of pre-cooked rice a little bit, so I already put that into my Macros Plus app, and then I just kind of steam it, I just add water, let it heat up, and then I bring my scale with me. Don't be afraid to bring your scale with you. If you want to keep track with it, it's just something you got to do. So, And you can always buy little pocket ones as well. Sometimes you just got to do it, and people are going to say some stuff, but it doesn't really matter. Now I'm just going to show you how I weigh everything out, and you know, it's not going to be perfect. You know, I don't know how much oil they're using when they grill the chicken or anything like that, but that's why I keep it pretty basic with bread, cheese, rice, chicken, and a salad. And I'll show you guys that all right now. So before I came in here, I was ranging around 200 grams of rice, pre-cooked rice, about four ounces of chicken, 35 grams of cheese, the spinach, which I have here. I don't weigh out because I'm not too worried about that as long as I get enough. So then I actually weighed it here and then I can go ahead and change everything on the app. So for this meal, meal number two, I have cooked rice, it came out to 162 grams. The chicken, I always do it with red meat because I know there's going to be more fat in there, and that came out to 6.8 ounces. Spinach, again, I'm just estimating. Cheese was 36 grams, and then I have cafeteria wheat bread, and I know that that's accurate because it comes in the actual uh, package. So I've got the bread right here. So this is what the final meal looks like. Salad, bread, cheese, grilled chicken, and rice. So again, don't be afraid if you're a college student to bring in your scale to have everything on your app. And I've got the camera sitting out here in the middle of the cafeteria. Don't let it bother you. There are ways around it. You know, there's gonna be temptations like the cake that's literally probably 20 yards away from me. Stick to your diet, the results will come. Just trust in the process. You can, your school should offer, you know, a salad bar. You should always have the basic like chicken and bread for sandwiches, rice. There are ways around that you can make it work. You just have to want to. So I'm gonna enjoy this. I've got to study for my test. 
Um, hopefully this has helped someone who's watching it. I really hope that it does. It definitely helps me, you know, stick to it. And I mean, this is a lot of food, so it's going to be pretty filling. But diet's going pretty well. Happy with the results. Today I had a pretty low weigh-in, but you guys will see that at the end of the week. And stay tuned for the next clip. Well, that test certainly kicked my butt. Um, yeah, so that test at 5 o'clock, it's not a class that I'm like interested in. You know, my second major is social and behavioral sciences, so this is a class that you have to take in order to graduate, because at the end we've got this big paper we have to write. But, uh, you know, just a lot going on. Glad it's over with, though. We got out of class pretty early. It's just about 6 o'clock now, and what's great, since it was just daylight savings day, you know, it's still light out and it's 6 o'clock, so it doesn't make me think like it's too late, which is good. I'm here at the gym because I still have to get my cardio in, and I think I'm going to hit abs. You know, I'm not feeling the best right now, kind of worn out. Um, I had a new low way, new low way in today, which was nice, and I've just been like, go, go, go. Sleeping has been off, but um, just because I've got so much on my mind. My project that's going on that I told you guys just briefly about, you know, that's just been like on my mind. I just want to work, work, work. So I like being busy. I'd much rather be busy and have things to do and things to accomplish than, you know, just sitting on the couch watching TV. That's just how I am. I've always been busy. And that's what I like. I like routine, I like structure. Um, so I was tempted just to like maybe go back to my house, eat a little bit, and then come back to the gym. But it is raining here, so. Just gonna get this workout in. Should be quick and easy. It's getting kind of packed, unfortunately. But just get our cardio in, get some abs in. Great feedback on the uh, recap video from last video, episode seven. So thank you guys for that. I kind of felt like I was all over the place when I was talking, so I'm gonna try to structure it a little bit more. But thank you guys for the great feedback. Really happy with how this series is going. Um, this was going to be like a day in a life kind of take you guys through and vlog, but with the weather, and everything's so busy, I will try to get a video like that later on in the week. This has kind of become my like new like talking spot. There's good lighting. Sometimes when I'm editing it like changes, but you guys can hear me, so I like this spot. I can look out kind of to the school. But that's probably gonna do it for this video. Hopefully short and sweet. But hopefully got something out of when I went to lunch in the cafeteria and how to balance that and just don't be afraid. You know, you can get a pocket food scale or you just bring your regular one to the cafeteria like you're gonna get looks but whatever you're doing something that's good for you so what does it matter you know I had my camera out there wasn't afraid of that I, it doesn't bother me so there's ways to work around it and if you're cutting and you're in college and you're on a meal plan and you need to go to the school cafeteria there's way to ways to be healthy so hopefully that helps someone watching this if it did help please leave a thumbs up Comment down below if you have any questions, and subscribe if you haven't already, and thank you guys all for the new subscribers, we've really jumped recently, so thank you to anyone who is new watching this, let's keep growing together, this is all about one big happy family, and I will see you guys tomorrow morning, which will be Wednesday already at 9am, so see you then, and as always, have a great week.